Stu. Santa's Thomas. come early, late. Santa's, Santa's come very late. Um, we have a special gift here from uh, I'm Fragile. Got me and you. Oh, the box was the wrong way. Best of best of British beer. Delivering a yes. better glass of beer. These guys, they hooked us up. Um, it was very nice of them. It's just 18 plus on the, the box. I'm hoping there's something saucy in here. Um, which you is got very, proof ID, son. Uh, <laughs> uh, Hold up my, to the camera. I see my other trousers. Um, yeah, hooked us up. Very nice of them. So we've got some special goodies to open um, and check out and kind of see because we've we kind of got no idea, really. We had a rough idea of what's in here, but it's all going to be a bit of a yes. surprise. So I'm excited. I know you're excited. Tried to get me up at 4 a.m. last night to, to open it up, to get on camera. You know I'm not at my best at 4 a.m. Do you know what I mean? I'm really not. Uh, Pre-makeup. I'm a real mess. So I thought we'd do it tonight instead when I'm all glammed up. Uh, are you ready to slice and dice? Man, flaps are out. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm pretty cut. I thought, I'm not going to be like <laughs> the yeah. silly lad. <laughs> mucking him out with a knife on camera as he a loses nice, a thumb. A manly pink no. knife. I'll uh, I'll have you know. So that's a very good idea. I obviously I don't think too far ahead to be honest. Normally, Preparation. <laughs> right. So the first thing on top, what we got? I, I'm Ooh. seeing a little red card. We have the uh, winner of the best picture at the Oscars for this year. <laughs> And the winner, the winner of best podcast, beer-related podcast of the year is the Logalogs. Woo! Lightly deserved, I think. Okay, here we go. We got a nice cheers card. Ooh, mm -hmm. each case contains six beers of top quality. It's a mixed style. That sounds good. That sounds good. So they do mixed dark, pale, and golden cider. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool, dude. Um, we are supporting a small family business, which is always nice to know. Ace. Um, and we got a bunch of reading material. Yes, I believe it was going to come with a, was it tasted notes? Uh, yeah, we got tasted notes. Uh, oh, okay, that's awesome. It's got a list of the brews and. Kind of a bit of a uh, behind the scenes on yeah, them. Yeah, the that's brewer really cool. draw. That's really cool. And the wheel of beer. Wow, that's that's really awesome. I don't know where have you got one of those. It's like the kind of beer types and where they Ooh. sit sit on the scale. Have they have they have they been listening to that, season two? That's a better <laughs> version of our wheel. <laughs> that, that is copyright infringement. If I uh, if I ever saw it, um, why not share what's tickling yeah. your tash? Uh, I don't think I don't think I want to, to be honest. Oh yeah, cool. Yeah, awesome. I was like a little beer bat. I do, mate. Me, me too. Me too. Brilliant. That's a nice little, uh, nice little bit of reading material for the toilet. Okay. Um, so yes. Six add, bottles. I'm gonna say, how do you want to do this? Left or right? Do you, do, you have uh, a, uh, do you have a British flag? I do. Do you want to pull the British flag out? Yes, I do. Of course, I do, buddy. Ooh. Ooh. bit early but a nice uh, a nice gift nonetheless friday gold golden yeah. out five six percent i've never ever seen a gold beer as strong as that the friday beer company from Worcestershire. i think that's the correct pronunciation yeah this is a award winning ale blend of american and english hops so it might be kind of a blend between maybe an apa and a and a golden beer or something. That's interesting. European uh, Beer Challenge 2021. They won a gold in that one. Well done, guys. Mm -hmm. Well done, guys. The science of good taste. That's awesome. That's really cool. Looking forward to cracking that one open. Um, okay. Left uh, or right? Or... I, I'm going to go for the H. Do you see that little H cap? I oh. do. I do. Let's grab that. Oh. A Cornish bitter. Now 
that looks good. Now that looks good. Brewed in North Cornwall. Mm. So it seems to be uh, mostly kind of independent, you know, brewskis, maybe like smaller uh, yeah, companies releases, which is which is really cool. I do like uh, trying stuff from what kind of stuff that's that, that's kind of not as well known as some of your your, your bigger names. So that's awesome. Yeah, exactly, it's good in a sense that it gives access to like people like me up here in Scotland. Yeah, of course. These, like, these uh, independent beers that you won't find in Sainsbury's sure. or Aldi's or Little. No, for sure, mate. It's brilliant. It's brilliant. So. That looks really good. Um, you just just blacks to choose from now, buddy. Oh no, we got um, one one gold. Yeah, go for gold, Thomas. Go for gold. Okay, hop on. Brew sixty one. Copy IPA. Okay. Brom's Grove. Oh, it's not suitable for vegans. That's it. I can't drink it. Furious. Oh, I can see the bacon inside it right enough. There's a good bit of that whole garden. It's going to oh, be no. a bit savoury. It's haram Hoppy and I'm vegan. I'm screwed. <laughs> um, yeah, it's local the, beer for another, local another, people. Another kind of local number. Yeah, that looks, um, that looks good. I like the um, designs of labels. Quite quite clean, quite yeah. to the point. You know? They're cool. They're really cool. Um... Right. Okay, let's just pull a black top and let's see if we can play snap. Okay. Three, two, one. No. <laughs> 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 that was shit. Kuru. Oh, it's Welsh, of course. Sure. <laughs> That's why I can't pronounce it. Sure, wow. Fantastic. I really want to try Ooh. more Welsh beer after the... The brains, I think I had it was uh, uh, brains. I think it was called. I tried last year, which was kind of really good, um, really nice ale. Um, so I've been looking to kind of try some more. And this, it seems to me like it fits the bill. Oh, so, uh, pronounced Kuru. Yeah. Any beer in Welsh? Um, I think it's. Are you trying to find out what type? That's what I was looking for. Yeah. Yeah. That's, uh, it's a. Rich multi flavor and fruity palette, so I'm assuming that it's kind of a, it's either a bitter or well, you know what? It's beer, it's so beer. I'm happy with that, yeah. Beautiful, I'm really right. looking forward to that. Really good selection so far. Okay, what else we got? Three, two, one. <laughs> <laughs> The, the, the delay on this call is shocking. <laughs> we, we got Red Rock Brewery Lighthouse Session IPA. That sounds nice. I and see. I believe that's what their little insert was about the the brewer's role of Red Rock Brewery. Red Rock so Brewery. that's actually nice. And you know what? It's the fine line of not too much reading material. Yeah. Like, yeah. Whilst Beer 52 go above and beyond and you get like a almost like a small book magazine every yeah, month. Yeah. I've never read one yet. If you're illiterate like us, we can't, we can't you know what I mean? Well, there's no use for them. There's absolutely no use for them. But, you know, beer, we know how to drink. So these will suffice. Devon. So you've got a couple of IPAs, we've got a golden and a couple of a couple of bitters uh, yeah. so far, which is which is awesome. Last but not least... Oh, hop a weaver. Hop weaver. Hop weaver. This one. Hop weaver pale Four percent. So um, that's 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 a bit of an interesting one. I don't I don't quite know what that would be. Or are you familiar with uh, Nethergate? No, none of these. Um, I've heard before, heard of before. Uh, so looking forward to. To try and this stuff, mm -hmm. Stour Valley Brewery. Yeah, I mean, this might be. Um, I don't know. It might be kind of a bit of a, like a bottled bitter or something. Or, yeah, uh, five point four percent. I mean, that's uh, that's quite interesting. Mm -hmm. And you know what, what stands out is the fact that it's in the clear glass. I like that. Bottle. Yeah, I like that. It looks like a cider, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Good colour to it. So. 
That's like my, my sample after a, a week on the piss. Yeah, I was exactly waiting for him to what, say that, and he didn't exactly disappoint. Exactly how it looks. Am I that predictable? So. Um, wow, I think that's a really good selection. I think that's... It is a nice mixture uh, of traditional. Some kind well, of mod, modern art inside as well. It looks good on the wall. Um, I don't know where you're supposed to hang that or place it on a... There, on there's a, a nice little blue bin for that. Wait, good, sorry, oh. grey bin. Up okay. Here. <laughs> That's what I think of recycling, okay. We're doomed. So, um, oh, this is like a part mistake. one, because a uh, part two is going to be uh, like a companion podcast where we are going to... I'm sorry, can you hear my children screaming, what's up? Screaming bloody murder. Like, why are they like reenacting Budweiser commercials? You really need to start letting them drink you know it's not quiet it's not it's not good it's not good it's not good parenting sorry yes anyway so we're gonna be back and we're gonna be drinking these beers or some of them and you know first episode of season four we're gonna be doing the other half of this box we've done like the first part we've looked at the beers the second Mm -hmm. part of the podcast we will have tasted the beers. We've tasted the beers. Um, yeah, we're looking forward to blasting through them. As Stu said, yeah, we've got a Valentine's Day massacre special coming up to assault your eardrums with. And I'm really looking forward to, I mean, all these beers, but yeah, in, between, in particular, the, uh, the bitter and the, um, the Welsh brew, whatever that may well, be. You know uh, what? I've- I think since it's a special type of podcast itself, I think we should just choose two beers. And we don't need to have the same beers because we have six different to choose from. Mm. So that's, choose that's really two beers idea. that you want to have and I'll choose two beers I want to have. I think that's a really good idea. I was thinking maybe we just drink them all and just sit in silence. I just will. Re- just record that. Well, I now know what this Hopefully box that's is interesting. For. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's a, a really good idea, mate. Yeah, I think that really is. 